Hello, my beautiful sweets. It is the next day, and it is a beautiful day out here today, y'all, but it is breezy. Look how that is flying all over the place. I put my um, fake plant out here that I got from roses, and it, the wind is literally blowing the leaves off of it. I'm like, what in the world? But on another tip, these are doing very well. They're coming up. Got some fake leaves in here. Oh my goodness. Oh, she looks dry. She needs some water. I planted my strawberry plant last night or yesterday. So I'm waiting to see how that's going to come up. And these look really good, but I got to put some water in here. I uh, wanted to share with you guys a small little... Um, well, I don't know if it's small or not. I think it's a big one, y'all. <laughs> Dollar Tree haul. And yeah, that's the AC. You guys hear if you hear anything. So I wanted to heat up my coffee. I hope everybody is having a wonderful... What is today, y'all? Friday? Yeah, I think it's Friday. Hey, y'all. <laughs> it's Friday. Feels like a Saturday to me. So I'm on my second cup of coffee and we're just gonna heat that up i'm trying to figure out what to do with my little bumblebee apparels you guys that i have my creative juices are flowing but uh, they're not flowing in the right direction i've got all these bumblebee things that i bought queen bee i already started i already um bling these out these are the believe in yourself flip-flops and i have this wire wreath form that's making life very easy. And then I've got these flower sack towels. And so I'm trying to figure out what I want to do and what I want to make here because I'm really, really digging the bee, <laughs> the bee motif. But I did find one of the washcloths to match this um, yesterday that's coming up in, um, in the hall. And I was excited, but I did not find the dish towels or the mitts. They hadn't put them out yet. So I got to go back there today and see if they put those out yet. But yeah, so I want to come up with something creative, you know. Y'all know I got to do me. I got to let my juices flow the way I want, to, want them to flow. I'm trying to, hold on, let me take a sip of coffee. Mmm. Mmm delicious I'm trying to get these bags these mother day bags mother's day bags together because I've got way too much stuff you guys as always not all this stuff is gonna fit into those little small bags but as you can see I just wanted to prep and get these things ready because next Sunday is Mother's Day and it's coming it's creeping right up on us and like I said before I have some cooking that I have to do for the Mother's Day dinner, so yeah. I've got six piles here, but not all this stuff is gonna go in there because I still have more stuff to um, to put in there, but it's, we'll see, because I'm gonna film it and show you guys. So we're gonna go out here and I'm gonna sit down and do this haul real quick, but let me heat this coffee up one more time because it is not hot enough for me. I'll be back, guys. Okay, my sweets. I am back and I've got quite a size uh, haul here today, you guys. So get your tea, your coffee, your juicy juice, as Sharon, she so fabulous would say, and relax and sit back and let me show you guys all the stuff I got. But now my coffee's finally hot. Mm -mm -mm. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this video. Thank you so much for coming back and returning and supporting my channel. I wanted to show you guys the review on the Panda phone holder that I got. I told y'all guys, I really don't ever use these, but I decided to just go ahead and put it on. And I have to let, have my phone flat, which I don't really like because my phone already has the like stand on it. Oops, sorry. But yeah, you have to sit it down and then, yeah, there we go. And it looks like this. Eh, I don't bother with that. I always take my phone out of the case and put it in my alternative case, which I have, you know, one of these things on the back of it. So you can sit it, you can stand it, 
and it'll stand and rest on that so I've had that for a while it's kind of old it needs to be replaced but I just wanted to show you guys that and let's see I found some cute stuff yesterday and day before yesterday and day before yesterday yeah and day before yesterday <laughs> Y'all know I go to that Dollar Tree almost every day. I try so hard not to, y'all. But it doesn't always work. So, anywho, I know all the hard candy stuff is out. It's coming out and a lot of people is um, scoring it. And it's great. But you know what? I still have all those palettes and all those glow-ups and stuff that I haven't gifted to you guys yet. So, if I don't find it, it's not a big deal to me because... I am overloaded, you guys. So let's jump right into this haul. Yesterday, I was at the Dollar Tree and I saw the double pack. Y'all know they sell these all the time. Excuse me, itchy eyes from the allergies. But I decided to buy these because <clears throat> it is so much easier to get my tape off of here. Now y'all know I love the Flamingo and the Unicorn just because they're cute. But they are not really, really workable like this unicorn one right here. To get the tape started, it's stuck to here. But I can never ever get it out without taking like a nail file or digging up underneath here to get the tape out. And then when I do get it out, it's this little cutter thing. It's not that great. We're talking a dollar, so I mean, to just sit it on your desk and let it look cute, I think it's fine. But when it, when you're trying to tape something down oh it's annoying and the flamingo i've had many of these this is probably like my third or fourth one again this is a good starter point but when you try to well it did easily that time but normally when i'm trying to cut the tape on the ridge it gets all twisted up and stuff so yeah i just decided i'll just go ahead and get me some regular tape and see if that'll work a little bit better because nothing's more frustrating when you're trying to tape something and the tape is getting all twisted up or you can't cut it blah 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 yada yada okay moving right along i found some um interesting stuff now i normally don't buy these i used to buy a few bags here and there for my sister but i don't do that anymore so i saw these resealable bags captain crunch berries these are sweetened corn and oat cereals, and it was only one there yesterday. But when I looked at this bag, y'all, it was full all the way up to the top, y'all. I have never ever seen one of these little bags full all the way up. So I was very happy about it. And these are the kind of cereals where I just eat like popcorn, you know, or potato chips. I don't, you know, pour milk over them or eat them or like that. I just like to sit there and, and nosh on them like, a little snack so I love those and then I found these interesting interesting what is this <clears throat> quinoa tiny hero golden quinoa or quinoa however you pronounce it a mighty whole grain I usually don't eat stuff like this but I wanted to try it it's just a six ounce package looks like this I was like oh what do we have here the instructions are pretty simple it says um, Boil two cups of water, add a quarter cup of the quinoa or quinoa, reduce heat for 12 to 14 minutes, reduce heat and cook uncovered on medium to low boil until desired texture is reached. Then the fourth step is drain and rinse using a fine mesh strainer. How are you gonna strain this? I hope it expands when it, when it um, cooks because it says use a small mesh strainer, so I've never tried this before, but I would like to make up a nice healthy um, chicken bowl or turkey bowl with this, so we'll see what happens. They had lots of them there yesterday, but I only purchased one. Sorry for the itchy nose. Y'all know that's just par for the course. Mm. Okay, moving right along. They got the Vaseline Intensive Care Cocoa Glow. With pure cocoa butter, Evec, oh, that's in a different language, sorry. Body, it's a body cream. So I put this on my hands yesterday. I was wondering why did it feel so heavy and kind of sticky, but then after my hands absorbed it, it felt okay. But I thought it was a hand cream, 
like the Pond's was, but this is actually a body cream. And so I got eight of these. One I already marked with my S on it so that I would know which one I opened already. And the rest I'm going to put into the Mother's Day um, gift bags because I think my aunts will like this. My mom and my aunts will like this. So I got those. And then I found some more of the... <clears throat> the Pond's Light Moisturizer. Now, I really, really like this. And again, this says uh, Pond's formulated by the Pond's, blah, 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 blah. Light Moisturizer for soft and glowing skin. So again, I'm assuming this is a body, um, a body lotion, but I've just been using it as a hand lotion and I absolutely love it on my hands. I have one container sitting right over here and I keep it there. So I got one for each of them. I got several of these, so one of each of these is going to go into their Mother's Day bags. And I thought it was a great deal for a dollar, and it smells good. I like the way the pond smells, but the Vaseline, I, I'm kind of on the fence. It's real rich and creamy, but I will use it. I don't care. I'm take a knife and spatula and clean all that out and put that back in that jar, waste not, want not. But it does clearly say Vaseline body cream. So if you guys can see that, let's see. Let's see. Vaseline. Come on. Hello. Okay. It clearly says Vaseline body cream, y'all. So, okay. Moving right along. I found some. They have now. All week long, it's been their weekly wow has been um, the books, and they've had some really fabulous books out there this week. But I just don't have any room for more books, so I've been trying to limit myself. But now they've incorporated the movies, so they brought the movies back out as part of the weekly wow. And I found this old, old movie called Genie Bell. <laughs> Excuse me. It's TNT Jackson includes seven bonus movies and I was trying to see what year this was <laughs> this came out in because I was like oh my god I cannot see the year that this came out it says 2018 I thought it was much um, older than that but yeah I thought it was very interesting I didn't want to go overboard with the movies again because again all the other ones that I bought they're just sitting over there I haven't opened them but that one looked good it might intrigue me so moving right along they are finally finally getting <clears throat> our towels and dish sets to match my stove top and they finally got these only the washcloth so far and y'all know I already have the stove top set. I bought that months ago at the smaller Dollar Tree. And I've been waiting to find the, the um, washcloths, the oven mitt, and the dish towels to go with it. So I'm hoping that when I go back later on today, they will put out the um, oven mitts and the dish towels. But these come in two packs. They're not the best material, you guys. I mean... We're talking a dollar, two for a dollar, but I just use these as decorations, so I like um, having the whole set. And y'all know I showed you my girlfriend the lemon set that I bought her, and I've been waiting. And they finally came out with the washcloths only so far at my store. And so I got her the washcloths. This is when uh, life gives you lemons, make lemonade. And I think that's so darling, so very cute. And of course they have the mesh on the back of them which is why I like these even more so you know give a little scrub a dub dub to your dishes <laughs> so I got those two one for me and one for her and I have